In computer science, a parallel random access machine is a shared memory abstract machine. As its name indicates, the PRAM was intended as the parallel computing analogy to the random access machine, in the same way that the RAM is used by sequential algorithm designers to model algorithmic performance. The PRAM is used by parallel algorithm designers to model parallel algorithmic performance. Similar to the way in which the RAM model neglects practical issues, such as access time to cache memory versus main memory, the PRAM model neglects such issues as synchronization and communication, but provides any number of processes. Algorithm cost, for instance, is estimated using two parameters O and O, read-write conflicts. Read-write conflicts in accessing the same shared memory location simultaneously are resolved by one of the following strategies. Exclusive read-exclusive write. Every memory cell can be read or written to by only one processor at a time. Concurrent read-exclusive write. Multiple processors can read a memory cell but only one can write at a time. Exclusive read concurrent write. Never considered. Concurrent read concurrent write. Multiple processors can read and write. A CRCW PRAM is sometimes called a concurrent random access machine. Here, E and C stand for exclusive and concurrent, respectively. The read causes no discrepancies while the concurrent write is further defined as common. All processes write the same value, otherwise is illegal arbitrary. Only one arbitrary attempt is successful. Others retire priority. Processor rank indicates who gets to write another kind of array reduction operation like sum, logical and or max. Several simplifying assumptions are made while considering the development of algorithms for PRAM. There, there is no limit on the number of processes in the machine. Any memory location is uniformly accessible from any processor. There is no limit on the amount of shared memory in the system. Resource contention is absent. The programs written on these machines are, in general, of type SIMD. These kinds of algorithms are useful for understanding the exploitation of concurrency, dividing the original problem into similar sub-problems and solving them in parallel. The introduction of the formal PRAM model in Willie's 1979 thesis had the aim of quantifying analysis of parallel algorithms in a way analogous to the Turing machine. The analysis focused on a MIMD model of programming using a crew model but showed that many variants, including implementing a CRCW model and implementing on an SIMD machine, were possible with only constant overhead. Implementation PRAM algorithms cannot be parallelized with the combination of CPU and dynamic random access memory because DRAM does not allow concurrent access but they can be implemented in hardware or read-write to the internal static random access memory blocks of a field programmable gate array. It can be done using a CRCW algorithm. However, the test for practical relevance of PRAM algorithms depends on whether their cost model provides an effective abstraction of some computer. The structure of that computer can be quite different than the abstract model. The knowledge of the layers of software and hardware that need to be inserted is beyond the scope of this article, but articles such as Vishkin demonstrate how a PRAM-like abstraction can be supported by the explicit multi-threading paradigm and articles such as Carader and Vishkin demonstrate that a PRAM algorithm for the maximum flow problem can provide strong speedups relative to the fastest serial program for the same problem. Example code. This is an example of system very log code which finds the maximum value in the array in only two clock cycles. It compares all the combinations of the elements in the array at the first clock and merges the result at the second clock. It uses CRCW memory, M, I, less than equals 1 and max N less than equals data, I, are written concurrently. The concurrency causes no conflicts because the algorithm guarantees that the same value is written to the same memory. This code can be run on FPGA hardware. 
Module find max hash, type def n in bit, 1 to 0, compare, merge, done, state, 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 bit m, len, int i, j, always underscore ff it begin if begin for m, i, less than equals 0, state less than equals compare, and else begin case compare. Begin for begin for begin if m i less than equals 1 end end state less than equals merge n merge.